G'day and welcome to the Tech Math Channel. What we're going to be having a look at in this video is we're going to be looking at how to multiply thirds. Now a third is an irrational number which can only be exactly expressed using the root power, okay, the root button, the, the root uh, symbol. So an example this might be say root 2, okay. Uh, I mean if you work and calculate it, you get some irrational number, you get some decimal which would be say 1.414 blah 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 and we keep going on and on and on with this non-repeating sort of uh, decimal answer here and so we to get the more exact answer we actually when we're dealing with these we actually more exactly write it as a square root of 2. I know some people sit uncomfortably with this. So um, we're going to be looking at how to multiply these. So say I wanted to go the square root of 2 times the square root of 3. Now I'm going to use uh, a couple of non thirds to actually show you how to work these out. Rather than just throwing a formula at you, I just want to show you how this works. So I'm going to get back to that particular question. But the, way, the, the actual question I want to deal with is this one to show you how this works. So we have the square root of 4. This is not a third, by the way, because it can be solved uh, exactly. And we're going to multiply this by another non third, which is the square root of 9. So we can actually solve these. We can say the square root of 4 is 2, and the square root of 9 is 3, and we're going to times these. So 2 times 3 equals 6. Okay, and I'm just going to put one last thing here. This 6 here is the square root of 36. Okay, and what you might notice is this. The square root of 4 times the square root of 9 equals the square root of 36, and 9 times 4 equals 36. Okay, so this gives us a, a great little... Um, little rule that we can actually use here that, that does work by the way which is this one okay and this is the rule for multiplying thirds the square root of a times the square root of b equals the square root of a times b okay so back to our initial sort of question which was the square root of 2 times the square root of 3 the answer to this is the square root of 2 times 3 which is 6. Okay, so I'll give you another one of these. Uh, you're going to see how easy these are going to be. So say I did the uh, square root of 3 times the square root of 5. Okay, what's this going to be? It's going to be equal to the square root of 3 times 5, which is 15. That's really easy, right? Uh, now look, the only other modification that you might get to these when you get these sort of questions and look, I'm, I'm guaranteeing most of you people who ever look at this are going to get this as part of some maths type question homework or say something like this. Uh, well, we say something like this. Um, you might even get it where they you, you get this type of question. So 4 times the square root of 2 and we're going to multiply this by 3 times the square root of 7. And the way that you multiply these is much the same. You just deal with these numbers here first. So 4 times 3. 4 times 3 is 12. And we'll put the square root there. 2 times 7 is 14. Okay, now that's how to multiply thirds. The next video I'm going to be making up is going to be looking at how to divide thirds. Okay, um, anyway, I hope you find that a, a big help. We'll see you next time. Bye.